Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Samsung Galaxy S23 and let me share with you how to change this navigation type with the buttons to the gestures. So first of all we have to find and open the settings and now all you have to do is to find the display. Let's tap on it. Now let's scroll down until you will find the option which is called navigation bar. As you can see, it's right here. So let's tap on it. And here we've got two different modes, two different options from two controls. Of course, right now we've got the buttons option applied. This option is marked. And just a quick uh, disclaimer before setting the gestures, you've got the button order right here. So you can customize this mode if you will decide that you want to stick with this option. Now, so you can uh, simply reorder the back button and the recents. In order to set the gestures, we have to tap on this option. As you can see here, we've got um, kind of tutorial, kind of animation which will show us uh, how to use um, those gestures but of course I'll show you later on. Just tap on this option and as you can see the three um, buttons navigation will immediately disappear. Instead we've got this kind of line which will be responsible for particular uh, gestures and again I'll show you later on. Here you've got some options which you can customize. So we've got the gesture hand and the show button to hide keyboard. It's up to you if you want to use it and here you've got also more options and as you can see, you can decide if you want to swipe to open the assistant app and you can change the gesture sensitivity. And actually, I highly recommend to get back to this option after using the gestures for a while. So when you will get used to this, um, to this mode, to this kind of system and you will be able to decide if you want to set it lower or higher because as you can see this blue area um, is changing the size and thanks to this you can and decide how kind of receptive this device will be for your back uh, back gestures. So as I said, just use the gestures for a while and then come back to this option. So if you um, if you want to get back to the previous page, just by uh, just like by using the back button, you have to swipe uh, your finger from the bottom to not from the bottom from the side to the center of your device. And it doesn't really matter if you will do it from the left or the right side; it works the same. As you can see, after swiping this arrow will appear and I've accidentally got back <laughs> because after uh, releasing the finger your device will simply get back and the same situation from the right. Uh, if you want to get back directly to the home page then all you have to do is to simply swipe your finger from the button uh, from the bottom <laughs> to the center of your device and do it kind of fastly just like that just a quick motion and as you can see we've got the home page and in order to open the recents all you have to do is to simply again swipe your finger from the bottom to the center of your device but this time do it kind of slowly and hold your finger in the middle and as you can see here we've got the recents uh, so basically that's all. This is how to change the system navigation, how to set the gestures in your Samsung Galaxy S23. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this video was helpful and if it was, please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.